So it's just a quick review here, okay, for those of you um, who never took taken a Smith Francis course before. So of course, Peter took karate just like Mary never quit school. Will you? Okay. Ba, da, and ga. The B sound, D sound, hard G sound, and of course our guttural Q, like in Bach. Okay. Any questions about these 11 consonants? So we were talking about these long vowels, A, A, uh, okay? There's also, I guess, what they're called, elongated, I don't know, they call elongated consonants. And here they are, I'm just gonna show you. Here's number one, L apostrophe, okay? And for the life of me, growing up, I've heard this, you know, as a young boy, never thought anything about it. If you were to ask me to write this phonetically, I would just put I-L-L. -L. Ill. 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 You know? Not quite, eh? Ooh. 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 Yeah. Ooh. It, it's elongates the L sound, okay? And of all kinds of um, examples here. A Mi'kmaq person, or I guess it means, what do you mean, human being, I guess? I don't know, a human being. A people, yeah, a person. Bernie asked me, Curtis, can you say this word? And I was trying to look at it, eh? And I, and I was thinking, oh yeah, I know what he's doing. <laughs> all right, first of all, I don't see any macaronis at all, any apostrophes. So, when I see L in, I don't know, Lin, Om, Lin, Lin, I don't know. I'm not used to seeing it like that. Um, 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 no. Now, um, easy. See how that important that is? And it's just right here. And that's in a lot of words. Um, okay. Okay, I'll write them down here. here. Dog. Um, and I really don't. Uba. Uba. Like. Is it like. <laughs> What's it in English? Uba. <laughs> Uba. Really. Really. Like. Uba. I even hear Uba really. Uba really. Uba. <laughs> they get the two of them. <laughs> yeah. Uba. Uba. Yeah. Like really Uba or really. berry or something like that. I don't know. It does mean really. Yeah, really. It's like. Uh, Uba like, never more. That's the real thing. Okay, there we go. Yeah. Really. Okay. I'm going to put that in there. <laughs> does, does, so does that just clear the air a little bit with the L apostrophe? The ul. Ul nu. Ul muj. Ul ba. Mm. Look at that. It's not mm. It's mm. Mm. A little bit elongated. That's all it is. Um, it's almost like something. Something like that. Mm. Something like a, yeah. Mm. A little elongation to it, right? I know. Again, no vowels. Okay, but I'm just using this example right here. Mm. Gum. Din. Gum din. Yeah, it's a funny one, eh? Gum din. Yeah, I I'm sort of like trying to exaggerate this part here. Gum din. Now this means all it means is mountain. Mountain. And I got a lesson while I was at a language advisory with MK, with the uh, elderly ladies and retired teachers and professors, okay? This word here, okay? I remember writing it down, showing somebody, and it just so happened that, I think it was um, Barbara Denos, I think. She said, okay, no quiz, kundin, apostrophe. So, okay, then, because I was, I was taught this way. And if you really, if you're not fluent, of course I'm going to say it like that. But I would say kumdin. And she said, "Okay, say it again. What you what you read?" I said, "Okay, first of all, break it up. Kumdin. You're not saying kumdin. You're saying kumdin." I said, "Oh my gosh, you're right. That M is elongated. Okay. I'll try to pick up another one there. Oh yeah. This one too. Didn't know about it." 
until. Ah, someone. Someone. That is an S elongated a bit. You hear it? So, any questions about the M, the elongated M? It's just mm, as opposed to mm, mm. someone. Someone. Okay, that's all it is. What does someone mean? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm assuming. Maybe you forget. Wada. Water. N apostrophe. Just like the M. Remember, we had N. That's all it is. Okay. I'm trying to think of an example here. Try the one that I wrote the other day for gallon. You got a N apostrophe. That's right. Good. Okay. It's at the beginning here, right? Ngalao. Ngalao. Okay. And you should just very slightly elongating the N sound. It wasn't there. Ngalao. Like, gotcha. Yeah. You hear it? Yeah. Okay. And I like, I'm going to use that as an example too. My foot or leg. What's that? Foot or leg? Uh, foot. Foot. Gut. My foot. Right? But here, ngalao. See how the N is a little longer? That's all it is. Okay, so my foot and French word. Does anybody know what this one might mean? Gallon. Gallon. One gallon. One gallon, yeah. You don't say you don't say gut. Right. Gut. Yeah. Does that make sense now?